What's more impressive when it's done naked? Beekeeping. My friend works for a beekeeping company that puts out a nude calendar every year as a fundraiser. pbs.twing.com I'm gonna need more pictures. For research right? No, literally for masturbation purposes. At least you're honest. He is being very honest. Welding. Ask my how I got my winter sunburn. How did you get your winter sunburn? From the tanning bed, dumbass. I read this in Red Foreman's voice. Is there a vacant room in your ass? Because my foot is looking for one. Paraphrasing obviously. Training an attack dog. You just need peanut butter. And decent medical insurance. Perhaps Geo Blue Balls. Magic tricks. It'd love to see the disappearing pencil trick. I'm not quite sure what the implication here is, but all my inferences make me too afraid to ask. I would have thought you'd be more familiar with the techniques of nude magical arts, bush hiders. I would think the opposite. They are dedicated to keeping the bush hidden at all times. Spacewalk. It's cold as balls out there. Attending a sexual harassment seminar. If you have problems speaking, just picture everyone at the seminar naked. Sir, this is a Wendy's. Well, turns out they weren't lying, Wendy's really does have fresh meat. Where's the beef? Oh. Taking your phone out of your pocket. The old ham wallet. The old spam purse. The old taco saco. The old brown bag. The old wizard sleeve. The old prison pocket. Frying bacon. That's an extreme sport right there. More like suicide. Sue fried. Climbing Everest. Get ready to become halfway point naked guy. I wouldn't be surprised if there already is a naked corpse on Everest, don't people undress sometimes during extreme cases of hypothermia? Yes, it's called paradoxical undressing. Some suspect it's due to the body not knowing how to signal being that cold as your vasal system shuts down and it starts sending the same panic signal it would if you were really hot, so you start stripping clothes off. I've read it's thought to happen when the muscles constricting your blood vessels in order to reduce heat loss and keep vital organs warm become exhausted and relax. The sudden rush of blood back out to the extremities makes the person feel hot and in their confused mental state they assume they're overheating. Fun fact I experienced this this summer. I felt like I was burning up but had gotten myself so cold I was hypothermic. My temperature was off for months. That sounds awful. Trust me it was. I thought my friend was trying to kill me when she put a blanket on me. Stripping. Casually takes off skin. Welcome to the personal space show. A rousing game of twister. Ah, great spacing Lamau. Sounds like a cards against humanity answer. Skydiving. Flap 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 flap. It's actually blurp 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 blurp. Click at your own risk. I immediately clicked on that without thinking about the context of the thread. I knew exactly what it was going to be before I clicked on it. I spend too much time on the internet. Warbelarging vagina is the video that comes to mind, and I feel like I'm correct. It's nice how you put it into words. Running from the police on asphalt on a hot summer day. When I was in Air Force basic training, July in San Antonio, Texas, there would be situations where we would march as a flight on the blacktop. This pavement was ducking hot in the middle of the day when we would march an RMT, military training instructor, made some of the trainees do push-ups. I remember people screaming when they had to get down and push for fucking up the march. 
One guy's hand was so raw he couldn't even open any doors. Not sure if Armed he got in trouble for that, but he did end up going to prison for making trainees drink toilet water from their canteens. He was also involved in the Lackland AFB sex scandal and was investigated for having relationships with tech school airmen. Mimti, I'm assuming accidentally, halted us in fire ant territory. No joke, they were halfway up my legs before I noticed, and when they started biting I asked for permission to adjust before I started swatting them off. Our drill surgeons took us to a field of fire ant nest for our react to indirect fire training. Which is just marching, then diving to the floor whenever the drill surgeons whistle while screaming incoming. At the time, I hated it and thought it was straight up abuse. That night, I realized they were teaching us that nothing is more important in combat than being alert and ready to endure pain to survive. Now, years later and jaded as duck I'm pretty sure it was just abuse. Yeah that sounds like abuse. Horse racing. If jockeys could race naked, I'm sure they would. Anything to cut weight. Probably wear a speedo, to reduce drag. Why would a horse wear a speedo? There was a guy on the local news that fought a cougar while naked, cause it attacked his dog. I too like to get naked with cougars. Not completely naked though. Wear that rubber. Wild animals carry all sorts of dieses. Ah yes, safety first. Being an emperor and getting compliments on your new outfit. Hashtag X200B edit, thanks for the awards. Since so many people asked, here are links to the tale the emperor's new clothes and wikipedia.org wicket the emperor percent 27 new clothes anderson stew fear kershaw the emperor's new clothes html or similarly taking back the crown i'm a dressed up and naked i see what's mine and take it Ooh, yeah putting your hands in your pockets great now i have to slice holes in the sides of my thighs to put my hands in or if you're a girl, one hand in the butt and the other in the vagina. Bam. Guys though. Prospects are more grim. You didn't have to type that comment God help us all. Hot Pocket Jim Gaffigan approves this message. Naked? Playing airsoft and taking it like a pro, but with no clothes. It doesn't hurt much, but on sensitive uncovered skin. Ouch. Would hate to take a hit in the privates naked. Already been shot in the bits before, but with clothes. Fighting off a home invasion. Nah, nah, that just gives you an advantage. Imagine you're robbing someone's house at night, and some naked guy comes running towards you at high speed out of the darkness and human screaming optional but recommend. The inhuman screaming is that extra psychological effect. So is aggressively trying to take off the home invader's pants. Brings in a whole new level of fear. He has pants. Get the pants. Pulling wheelies on a motorcycle down the interstate going 80 miles per hour. Just imagine the pain down there 5 seconds and it's enough to make a grown man cry. Stealing the Declaration of Independence. Oh not a real treasure. All of these read like cards against humanity. Staying warm. Well that's what the PCP is for. A talent show. A Zoom meeting with co-workers. Cough cough tubin. The windmill. How would you even do that with clothes on? Well that's why it wouldn't be as impressive. Kinda seems like it would be more impressive if you could pull it off fully clothed. Opening a pickle jar. There's good naked, and there's bad naked. Presidential debates. If I had to turn on the TV and see Joe or Donald's flabby bodies and dangling nutsacks I'd probably have to kill myself.